and he said it doesn't look messy to me it's clean and i was like it doesn't clean itself i love your bit but morning it's currently half seven just ayla and i up at the moment i said still sleeping tim has really really bad hay fever we've never seen him have this before and i think because it's been so hot in northern ireland through a really long sunny spell like it has been i don't even know probably like two weeks and i'm still waiting it for it to rain there's so much pollen in the air we have something known as a pollen bomb where pollen levels are like the highest it's been in a while so tim is really feeling it and at times like this, it makes me feel so grateful that I don't have hay fever because everybody has different triggers or Tim, it's more like grass pollen, but for me, it's dust. So when I go to Hong Kong, I'm constantly sneezing, but I'm okay here. Obviously, Tim is not okay here, but he's okay in Hong Kong. I have been adding vitamin C into my water daily. I never liked the orange one, but the raspberry one is really nice. Yesterday, I had some time to burn, so I decided to spend 20, 25 minutes just on YouTube. And I didn't really have a specific video or a channel I wanted to watch. I thought I'll just do some browsing and see what's going on. And literally, about 15 minutes in, I closed my laptop. I don't know, maybe I was just on the wrong side of YouTube, but I just felt like I was seeing so much clickbait. Lots and lots and lots and lots of clickbait. And not that I'm judging because, hey, I've clickbaited in the past before, but I guess it just made me a bit sad to see like creators have to go down to this. Years ago, my channel suffered an algorithm glitch or a abnormality where it just really tanked the views on my channel. There really wasn't a lot that I could do about it. If you really think about it, it's quite crazy how little is in your control. It really doesn't matter how successful you are. You're literally an algorithm glitch from um, getting screwed. And I think because of what happened several years ago, um, it's kind of made me a bit more mm, um, about the further glitches that's happened. And that's why I'm really glad that years and years ago I decided to not rely on YouTube and just do other things, do other projects and now years and years later to see it get worse. Layla's back asleep again after swimming um, but as I was saying I also understand that there's a lot of you guys and it really is a livelihood so my advice is of course you know do what you can to grow your channel um, but at the same time it doesn't hurt to explore definitely do not put all your eggs in one basket especially when it comes to YouTube I don't think she's got enough hair for the stick actually <laughs> let's try again <laughs> one day currently visiting Granny Bob's. It's such a nice day and she's so nice. She let me borrow her hat. Like how stylish is this hat for a little old granny? Just chilling here, doing a bit of sunbathing with Granny Bob's and the dogs. Shopping with the great Granny Bob's. I'm just following her. According to Granny to tell if melon is good, you go like this. <laughs> she actually doesn't know why people do it. She's so fast, I'm struggling to keep up with her. What the? I never noticed, but my granny likes to drink Lucasaid. I forgot to show you guys some of the stuff I got yesterday. This one's from New Look. I like the print. Also from New Look, my mom picked this one. <laughs> My mom's really good at picking clothes. I also got one of these denim dungaree dress thingies. <laughs> this one's actually from Primark. It's just like a black maxi dress. That's far too long on me. This one is from Monsoon and I saw this randomly just sitting in the rack. My mom was trying clothes on. Originally 60 and I got it for 16 points. 
70% off. It's a bit big for me, but um, you know, maxi dresses, you can wear it slightly loose. Whoa! Keep holding, keep holding! And back you go, back you go! to my sisters and he had such a blast at the park. Ugh. I'm so tired. Mommy, I want you more. I want you more, Mommy. I love you more. No, I want you more. No, I love you more. No, I want you more, please, Mommy. I love you more. No, I want you more. I love you big much. I want you big much. I love you big, big much. I want you big much. All right, okay. We both love each other. Mm -hmm. What are you doing here? My mission today is to clear out this heck of an office. I've already done 50%, believe it or not. But um, yeah, I just have a lot of makeup sitting here and it's been years and years and years, years. Um, I'm sure most of them are expired. Heard about this 90-90 rule for minimalism where if you haven't used it in the past 90 days and you're not gonna use it in the next 90 days, best to get rid of it whether, whether you're binning it or donating it. Just no point keeping any of this stuff. For some reason, she just happens to be a really sweaty baby. <laughs> Happy. Yeah. Does it feel nice? Hold it for Lala. <laughs> Be careful, Ayla. Don't hurt the finger. <laughs> Tim had morning duty while I was able to uh, take my time waking up today. It was lovely, definitely worth it. For whatever reason, when when daddy takes over, it's like you're happy that they took care of the kids, but at the same time you realize there's a lot to pick up. It's exactly why a lot of, um, not all, but a lot of fathers are oblivious because you know Tim's always like, it's easy, it's easy. But then they don't know the stuff that you have to pick up afterwards. For example, like a few days ago, Tim saw me just completely KO'd in my bed, like completely sprawled out. And he was like, what's wrong, babe? I answered, oh, I'm just a bit tired. And he goes, why are you tired? And I said, oh, I've been cleaning the house. And he said, it doesn't look messy to me, it's clean. And I was like, it doesn't clean itself. I had to sort of give him a tour and basically educate him. The microwave doesn't clean itself. The oven doesn't clean itself. The hops don't degrease by itself. Neither does the, is a splash back or back splash. I get them both confused and I know they mean very different things. The fan extractor, the little handles, the stains in the kitchen cupboard, the floor, windows, the dusting, the washing. And then my husband was like, I help wash and I was like, yes, hubby, I really appreciate it when you put the clothes into the washing machine for me. But it doesn't stop there, you know, afterwards you have to take the clothes out and sort out the hundred pieces of clothing. I love you. Some of you guys say that you really miss seeing the dogs because they're not in the camera much. So sorry, guys. But I promise you that they're still looked after really well. <laughs> oh, oh, you okay, Tom? She's starting to take interest. She'll sort of go forward and back, forward and back. Maybe, oh, not today, maybe. Like this, like this, and then. She needs to not be changed, she's real bad. <laughs> Could he make it more obvious that he wants her to say Baba before she says Mama? What do you call that guy from, from Spirited Away?
I can't tell if she's angry or happy. You really happy with Daddy? Okay, no, she's angry. <laughs>